Hello and welcome to Murrow High School. My name is Ms. Chaburga. I'm the Assistant Principal of Security. We're showing you this presentation because you were unable to attend orientation in August in hopes that it will provide you important information that you need to start the school year. Just so you know some few fast facts about Murrow is we have almost 4,000 students enrolled plus 200 teachers and 150 roughly staff with only four floors. We are a city within a city. There is no fifth floor swimming pool, so please don't buy a ticket to it. We do have over 40 clubs and organizations to meet almost any interest that a student might have. But students, if you do have an interest that isn't matched by one of our clubs, talk to a teacher about starting one. There is no uniform at Moreau, but please do not wear any overly revealing clothing or see-through clothing. The cafeteria opens every day at 7.30 in the morning, closes between 1.30 and 1.45 each day. The library is open at 8 a.m. Tutoring is available throughout the day, as is the 285 suite open to students who are on OPTA. OPTA is another word for free period. However, please know that no student is allowed to leave the building during an OPTA during their school day. The building is not an open campus. So again, if you have an OPTA, otherwise known as a free period, you have these options, but not leaving the building. All of these items are prohibited in New York City public schools. Weapons, drugs, smoking or vaping, and Bluetooth speakers. Students, if you have a Bluetooth speaker, it must remain off and away in your bag during the school day. Many of us will be going back to commuting to school after a year and a half of being home. Please, for your own safety, pay attention to your surroundings. Don't play your music so loud that you can't hear what's going on around you. Also, do not pay so much attention to your phone that you're not sure whether you're on the sidewalk or the crosswalk. Only use a Murrow lock for your locker in the locker room. They are on sale, new for $20, used for 10 in the Dean's Office, 103. At some point, we all don't feel great. Please check with the nurse in room 299 if you're not feeling well. And parents, please take this opportunity to sign up for the electronic My Blue Card so that you can keep your emergency contacts up to date at all times. Students, if you are under 18, we will be contacting a parent to get authorization either to send you home or to get you picked up. Every entrance except for East 17th Street, the main entrance, is alarmed. Please, students, do not go through any doors that are closed where the light is red. You will set off the alarm and end up being sent to the Dean's office. Entrances open during entry and dismissal are the main entrance at East 17th Street, Avenue L, and Exit 5 on Chestnut Avenue. These entrances, except for East 17th, close at 8.30 in the morning. During dismissal, those same exits are open. Every morning, you must do a health screening, preferably before you come to school. I say this because at some point, it is going to snow or rain, and you don't want to be standing outside filling out your health screening. Please bookmark this link on your phone so that you can complete the health screening every morning before you come to school. Take a screenshot of the result. When you arrive at school, you should have your photo ID as well as your health screening to show us. If you choose to do the paper health screening every day, that is your option, but please know that it will take longer for you to enter the building. As well, face masks are still required of all staff and students and visitors in the building. Bandanas and gaiters are not acceptable. Student entry begins at 7.30 every morning, since first period begins at 8 a.m. We practice safety drills all throughout the year. We will do a number of fire drills and a number of soft lockdown drills. These drills are unannounced. Please note that we will not be socially distancing until we get outside for a fire drill. We are attempting to get out of the building as quickly, safely, and quietly as possible. Lockdown drills, for now, we will remain in our seats during a lockdown drill. The first day of school is Monday, September 13th. Please be here before 8 a.m. and bring your ID card. 
If you don't yet have your photo ID, we will take your photo during that first week of school. Every band meets on the first day, except for Science Lab. You also won't be changing for gym on the first day of school. You will be reporting directly to your phys ed class. Don't worry, it will be chaotic and hectic and confusing for so many, but we're all here to help. Finally, here are some offices and rooms that you might want to make note of. The Dean's office is in room 103. We handle photo IDs, locks, lost items, if you need to call your parent, etc. The guidance counselors are in the 124 suite. Missing Gordo's office, the AP of organization, is in room 104. The nurse's office is in 299, and the parent coordinator is in 109. As always, please check the website regularly at www.ermurrohs.org for updates. Thank you so much, and we're looking forward to seeing you in the 2021 school year.